Hi, I'm Tom Stickney, Golf Magazine Top 100 Instructor, and today I want to talk to you about what I call piddling around the greens. You can see I have a pretty straightforward shot right to this middle pin or what have you. I've grabbed two different clubs. I have my 60 degree sand wedge and I have a 9 iron. The reason why I want to do this is I want to experiment with what types of shots can I hit to get this 60 degree wedge close. Can I put it up in my stance and fly it? Can I put it back in my stance and run it? What can I do with my 9? Can I bump and run it? Can I open it up, cut across it? You know, what do all these different shots do? And the reason why I want you to piddle around the greens is because there are a multitude of shots that you can hit here. You can see we've got a mown down area close. There's a little valley. The green's right here. So I could just as easily bump it down into that slope and run it up that slope as I could, take my six degree wedge and fly it the whole way there. You have to figure out what works best for you. And there are times when you want to put it on the ground. There are times when you want to hit it up in the air. But unless you come over here and piddle, it's going to be really hard for you to understand how a nine iron is going to react versus a six degree sandwich. So take your time, take your cocktail, put your earphones on and walk around the green and just experiment with all different clubs. And you're going to find that the more you experiment, the better you're going to be around the greens.